Hello and welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brent and today we are looking at the best ways to get black lotus and uh, black pearls in wizard 101 um, Obviously, I have a lot of black pearls and there's actually another way from this way that you can get black pearls quite easily um, But I'll be going over that in another video um, for now, Black Lotus, I would recommend going to Vestraland, which does require you to have quested basically uh, halfway through, halfway I'd estimate, through, um, through, uh, Winter Tusk. Um, so you do have to complete both Grizzlesheim and then half of Winter Tusk. And over here, there are three Black Lotus spawns that you can just yoink. Um, one here, one over here. And one here and sometimes there is instead of one of those there's one behind here which again you can get but there will only be three in a world and then basically you can hop worlds um, also along here there's a whole bunch of reagents over this way as well um, like ore for instance um, so it's another way to get ore um, there's one there and I think there is another one over here somewhere possibly maybe it's been a while since I've done this uh, deep mushrooms are there which is actually really useful two of them I didn't even realize that that's actually really good that's really good I need some of those at the moment uh, and then there's a silver chest spawn up there and one up there a wooden chest up there but yeah that's probably the easiest I'll quickly show you that there will be three per world generally um, so let's for example go from Kelvin to Dwarvogen where I normally am um, and we will see that over here there is again uh, three three black lotuses slightly different place one can also spawn over here I don't know if we had that before but yes one can and then another one here so yeah as you can see very very useful spot and again with the deep mushrooms just over here not too bad at all um, I didn't even remember that they were here because it's been so long but yeah, if you have any other suggestions for best places to get reagents, or would like me to try and figure out some best place to get said reagents, please let me know down in the comments below, and I will um, hopefully get around to making those videos. Um, because, yeah, it's kind of useful to know exactly where to get them. Ignore my stitch as well, I'm trying to get energy gear for um, pet training because there might be a video on that later this week. Um, but yeah, anyway, thank you for watching. Remember to leave a like and subscribe. If you're already subscribed, press the wee little bell so you know exactly when I post another video. And remember to craft outside the box.